Alright, so welcome to Riddickville Boxing. We are doing career mode. Uh, I gotta name my guy. How many characters do I get? Floating. Probably shouldn't go too big with it because I have to input the name, but we'll try. Oh, floating platform. There we go. <laughs> so I got a few different head designs here to choose from. It could be baldy. It could be headband. It could be slick. It could be uh, Irish. 1920s potato farmer. I could be a douchey YouTuber. I could be a standard dude. I could be dreadlocks. None of them really match me. If there's like a more of a darker colored guy with the floppy hair, then maybe I would do that. Um, I will be, I'll be slick, and then skin color, uh, just two tones available, I will be the palest man alive. Okay, so I got a little bit of power and speed and stamina I can work with, I could pretty much just be relatively balanced I think, maybe put a little bit more into speed and power in terms, instead of stamina. And then I think we're good to go. Da ding Oh, there's my starting password. I'm not going to write that down. Because if I don't win like the first couple matches, then I have no business playing this, really. Hey, Chinoko. Welcome. Did I escape Tazlan? I did. It took uh, a couple tries. It took, some, took a little bit of effort, but it wasn't too bad. Thankfully, there were passwords in that, too. Alright, so I start out... 25th in the world, I had to climb my way up in the ranks. If the guys have heads, then I can face them. If their heads are blacked out, they're not eligible for me to fight quite yet. Um, this is a game that I originally played on the SNES. My neighbors either owned it or rented it, or both. I don't remember. Um... And so I bought this on a field trip where we had, and there's Riddick Bo at the very top. He's going to stay at the top, and that's our that's our goal, is to fight and beat Riddick Bo. Never seen anybody do it, including other challengers. Uh, but yeah, I bought this game as, uh, when I was at like a KB Toys or something like that, as part of, you know, when I was on like a school field trip that in Washington, D.C., um, and we just happened to spend a little bit of extra time at like a mall or something like that and I picked it up and played it a bunch but never got there. We're gonna fight Ralph Mahler. Do I get to fight elder chores with no heads? Uh no, they grow heads before you get a chance to fight them without. Sadly. Oh jeez. I gotta get the hang of this here. I think for the first couple matches you can kind of button mash a little bit more. The way you block is you hit A and B at the same time. But yeah, there's a couple different options for... I'm seeing a lot of weird weirdness on my TV screen. Is that showing up on... Yeah, it is. Okay, that's not fun. And the more you wear them down... You can see there's like that little gray bar uh, 
on his health. That means he's not going to recover beyond a certain point if he takes too much damage. What is going on with my... I don't like... I don't like what I'm seeing. I'm not expecting a first round KO or anything. But once the first round is done, I'll see if I can adjust the uh, picture here. Maybe just fiddle with the chords a bit here. Only landed 42% of my punches, but I got more than him. Now it's not happening. That's weird. Causing it. At the end of that first round, I adjusted the chords and I think it just, uh, <laughs> something about how I have my capture card set up. It just makes things stupid. So, yeah, that's the end of the first round. Let's, uh, let's dive back in. Body blows big time. Jeez. Oh, really? You're going to taunt me after I've been, like, wailing on you? Okay. Not a bad second round. So, yeah, they recover health every single round, and so do you. But there's, like, a max based off of how much you hit them. Some of these guys are just very much tough to get a hit in. close there. It's gotta be close to a knockout, right? His health is like basically nothing. Okay. 
Is he gonna stay down? Oh, I was close. I think they have the ability to, um, taunt to get, like, health back, perhaps. Definitely have this in terms of, uh, points so far. There's that. First match is done. All right, so yeah, each each match after that, um, or after each match, you can improve your stats a little bit um, with a couple different options. So I got free weights, speed boots, sports drink, which increases everything all around, which is probably what I'm gonna end up doing here. Um, and now I'll just go ahead and I'll take the password. Oh, I should probably, I have to write down what my name is, don't I? Uh, well, no, I don't. It's just floating platforms. As far as I can. Floating platforms. Okay, there we go. And now for the password. I don't know if that's a zero or not, but I'm, I'm going to write it down. I don't think I'm going to need to, because I'm sure I'll win at least one more fight. But I'd like to become undefeated for the first few rounds at least because you only get 70 not 70 you only get 40 total uh matches in your career mode and then it's game over no matter what so i'm gonna try to do well all right so i got the password down i think i hope and now And now we move on. All right, so I moved up a couple places. I'm I'm 23rd place. Um, I forget the name of the guy who I just fought, but he might be out. Some of these guys will like retire, uh, or you know they'll age out because they'll continue boxing. They're not just going to sit there and wait for you. As you battle, they also battle. So I like I don't know. I just really like the realism of it, or you know the potential realism of it. So I got this guy who has a lot of stamina but not much power. And not much speed, or I could fight this guy who has tons of power, but he'd be easy to knock out because he has very little stamina. I think I'm gonna go for the uh, going for Peter Parks. We're gonna go for Spider Ma. I do wish there was a little bit of music as these battles happen, but what can you do, right? Ooh, coming out the gate. pick my battles here I don't want to oh so it's gonna let me do it okay I 
Oh, now he's back down to nothing. He's not letting me do it anymore. I'm seeing a lot of... Oh, I'm still seeing the issues with the... the screen. Don't know why that's happening. is, uh, I, I did good on that one. Hit about 50% of the time. Really, um, got his stamina bar going. Something you'll also see as you go forward, um, the portrait will also have a bar that will raise. So it's like a separate stamina bar for just, like, the head or something. I don't fully know how it works, but I'm really surprised that this dude's, like, going that bar is going as quickly as it is. Damn, Peter Parker, you ain't doing shit to me right now. hits off they're they're fast sometimes I got the crowd on my side though I thought there was a like outside chance I was gonna be able to knock him down at the end of that second round, but I mean, look at that stamina. He's he's going down. But yeah, with that that uh, that sliding bar, he has less and less of a chance as the rounds go on, as he gets weaker. Ooh, he's getting aggressive. faster than me it's tougher to tougher to deal with my uppercut doesn't have much reach of course so if he's doing those low jabs I don't have the chance to counteract and get it in before he 
goes for those body blows. thought I was going to be able to knock him down that round going in but he was just a little bit too aggressive I mean that's one of the things I like about this game is that it's, it seems I don't know if it's like realistic is the word it seems more like a realistic thing it's not super arcadey but it's also not like super difficult to get into like you can use strategy like Rounds can go multiple rounds, or uh, fights can go multiple rounds. There's variety in the punches, the sprites look good. Like overall, it's pretty good. I, I enjoy it quite a lot. But it does hurt the hands, because you have to... So what you have to do to get there. That's a knockout, there we go. Will he stay down? Before I get too far in this, um, where's my manuals? I want to try to uh, double check my manual to find out how I'm supposed to get up if I get knocked down. I think it's just button mashing, but I just want to make sure I don't also have to like hold up or like tap up fast or something weird like that. Because uh, I have a feeling I'll probably get knocked down in one of these next two fights here. So we'll pull that up here before I get started. Alright, let's see. me but yeah there's like multiple multiple um multiple different like you can do a, a hook or a jab depending on whether or not you're like pressing left or, or i'm sorry right there is no real left so if you're if you're trying to dive in um or or if you're just like standing still and hitting a and b it's a different thing um you hold up for uppercuts you go down for the body jabs and whatever and you can also do jabs and hooks to the body depending on whether or not you're going up and i'm sorry right and down or just straight up down um let's see here replenishing your energy and strength after each match in career mode you can go to the gym and replenish your skills yep getting off the canvas take too many punches and your fighter will end up on his back uh to pick your fighter up off the canvas rapidly pressing both the a and b buttons and the control pad how fast your fighter recovers depends on the power of the punch that put him down as well as the number of times he has been knocked down and how much damage he has sustained during the fight the more your fighter lands on the canvas the more difficult it will be to get back up okay that's what i assumed so yeah got a heavy bag which will give me a lot more power uh sports drink or speed boots. Um, heavy bag might not be bad. I don't have like tons more power. I can knock out guys quicker, and it still gives me like a, just about as much stamina as the sports drink. Really, not much difference. The speed is a big differentiator, but I can possibly make that up with the separate speed boost later. So I'm gonna go with the heavy bag. I will not write down this password. I'm going to risk it. We're going to move on. All right, so, uh, yeah. You can see there's new guys coming up on the bottom here. And Peter Parks is, he's gone. 
So I can do this guy who's pretty low, and John Kramer is also pretty low. I'm relatively evenly matched. I feel like Peter Parks was a tougher opponent than what Patrick Murphy is advertised to be, so let's go with this. 35 fights, so he's an older guy. I'm not sure how much that really matters in terms of um, everything, but... sure how to do that taunt. <laughs> I like trading. Uppercut. Attempts. guys have stayed low. I like that they have like different tactics so I have to like kind of learn this shit and he's he's been the tougher tougher guy so far that's for sure. Don't be surprised if this goes like six rounds. is I'm trying to protect my body, but every time I even try to protect my body, that's when he goes for the uppercut, so I feel like I shouldn't even bother trying that. Dude definitely got the upper hand on me there. Alright. So that was a better round for me for sure. Okay. Ugh. Good God. Every time. I don't know how to defend against this. 
the fuck am I supposed to do on that? When I try to block low, he just immediately goes for the stupid uppercut. Solid, solid round. Mm. God damn it. <laughs> I thought I was doing okay getting around him, but no. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. still relatively even. Nice. He scored a 9 even though he got knocked down. That's really surprising. God. I can't I can't get damn thing going. We are a lot more evenly matched than than I want. 
Oh, you coward. Ugh. Get it. Damn. Oh, that was tough to get. He's hurting me. so annoying <laughs> I try and like not do anything <sighs> man the skills are the body blows and like as soon as I barely block the body blows he goes for the uppercut instantly and I'm just trying to get a single punch on his head while he's going for those things and that just doesn't work either because he's I guess slightly faster than me that's my guess oh. motherfucker I've been got you on the ropes you can really you're really gonna taunt me? Can you not get up? Ugh. I really wanted this fight to be over in this sixth round. I thought there was a good chance of it. I can't believe he hit me with that one. It's my cartridge, or if it's uh, the connection, or what, but. Thank you. Damn, he's gonna get up again? Ooh, close one. I thought for sure he was getting up. Alright, I did beat him in the sixth round after all. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Alright, let's definitely take down this password. Hmm, you look promising, but you need more experience. Hey, thanks, champ. You know, that's not... Uh, you know what? Hey. <laughs> hey, wait, where's my password, though? Jump rope. Multi-gym. I think I gotta go with multi-gym. Okay, there's my password. I was worried that it was... Okay, it's after your upgrade. All right, so X O Z. I don't know if it's zero C zero or O. I don't know. We'll see. I guess, huh? X O Z J Z P four B B C J S F B. I hope I got that right. X O Z L Z P L, not J. Ah, that could have been bad. X O Z L Z P four B B C J S F B. Got it. So yeah, Riddick Bow has noticed me. Just a few matches in. So now I'm <clears throat> ranked 19th in the world. 
after only three fights. Um, the thing is, so there's Patrick Murphy. That's the guy I beat. His stamina went up. Interesting. Um, I feel like I might want to probably slow things down and just go like kind of one by one here. Because look at these. I mean, Court Thorley, dude's a beast, but he loses a lot and he's fought a lot total. Um, Alan Smithy is more comparable. Like, I feel like I want to like go one by one so I can increase my stats a bit better. That's really the biggest benefit to going one by one. But you can always, I could always go back down and like fight some of these guys. Like I could fight Patrick Murphy again if I wanted to. Alright, we're going with Alan Smithy. hard to dodge after you or block right after you throw a punch this dude's tough it's almost as if he's ranked higher than me or something huh oh good That did not feel like a good round for me. But no, just relentless. My only option is when he just stops with the stupid body blows and I can, he does that uppercut and if I block it I can come in and get a couple like that but it usually means taking a couple of those stupid body blows because I don't want to leave myself open to the uppercut which I feel is probably going to be a little bit more powerful I 
think I did alright there. Yeah, he was quite aggressive. Thankfully, I was able to block more of it. His overall health is in a poorer place than mine. Like after like a few punches they would give you an opening but it just doesn't always work out that way so you have to sudden I can't get anything in. Interesting to see what like Riddick Bo will be like. I remember when I played this as a kid that some of these matches definitely went into the twelfth round. I fully expect that to happen as I get further in. Yeah, 122 punches. the strategies are you just gotta kind of try different things and see what works and right now the mix of like body blows and then over to uppercuts is working pretty good or had been I can't believe I got hit by that stupid uppercut there Oh, you gotta be kidding me with that. How are you not down yet? There you go. got a second second uh whatever knocked down but still i got 10 versus 8 
Nice, that's super solid right there. That was, uh... I felt like I was in the zone a little bit. Maybe I can get a second knockout on him. Now I know I can, like, go after his body a bit more and be a lot less vulnerable than, um... the previous guy. It's like a valid strategy on this dude, whereas it wasn't on the other guy. Two in a row. Two in a round. God, I hate those glitches. I'm hoping it's just like a cart or something. I don't know. Next time I play this, I'll try to clean the cart a little bit or something. I didn't even clean it. I just put it in the system. It worked pretty well. Heck yeah. Definitely got the points advantage if it should manage to go all 12 rounds, which I seriously doubt. Easy way to go is the body blow immediately followed by the uppercut. It's nice when it works. Yeah. 6th round KO. Heavy bag, sports drink, speed bag. Ooh, okay, that's not bad because it increases my stamina a little bit, right? It increases my speed a lot more, but it still ups my power. I think I gotta go speed bag. That's pretty good. It's a good option. Alright, let's get this password down, because I definitely feel like I'm going to need them after each round now. So we got XL1, J, Z, P4, G, S, C, J, N, Q, Z, did I get that right? X, O, 1, J, Z, P, 4, G, S, C, J, N, Q, Z. Okay. All right. I could go after Alan Smithy again. All right, so here's the thing, right? Because I have... 40 matches in order to beat Riddick Bow. Um, age, I think, is a factor in this game. So, like, if you, you know, the older you get, like, the little, you know, you're going to start to lose some of the stamina here and there. Uh, like, this next guy, he has tons of power. He's pretty comparable in terms of speed and stamina. Brian Howarth is like a beast I don't want to even try at this point. So I feel like as I go up this chain, I need to boost up my stats a bit more. And probably what I'll do is, yeah. So Riddick, he's maxed out. He's like, he's Mr. Mr. Max. So I need to get my stats close to maxed out before I can fight him, which means I'm going to have to spend a little bit more time down here. So what I think I'm going to do is actually fight Alan Smithy again. Alright. And then hopefully just get a little bit more 
Do a nice little rematch. I thought I was. Didn't look like I was even starting to throw those punches when I. Mm. got him down on the first round. Oh, nice one. It can be tough to block, like if you're not in like a neutral position when he starts throwing punches, it's just, uh, it's tough to block with both hands. Really? I don't, hmm. Jesus Christ, okay. I was trying to do multiple punches on his body. I got one in and then he took over. I thought I had more speed than this guy now, but maybe not. for the head but he he did the body blow which knocked me down and forced me to swing lower than I was trying to Did 
There we go. I was gonna say, like, why have it? It's really hard to knock these guys down because their their energy has to be really at the very very bottom. And a lot of times it looks like it is, but evidently there's like a tiniest sliver that's not very easy to see on such a tiny screen. Oh, we had the same idea, buddy. Oh. Oh. Give me that quick knockout. Yeah. Third round. Oh, do I do speed boots? Let's go all around. All right. And again. Doing passwords each time. I know it's not as fun, but it's kind of necessary. 701 GZ P6 GB CK K J This will also help if I happen to write down a password incorrectly. Then I can uh, go back to a previous one and not lose a whole lot of progress. Alright. I could do Alan Smithy again. I could do Rob Terrier. Or I could go up one to Robin Coltrane, who's pretty close. I hate that. I hate that flickering. I don't want to adjust anything. Because I'll lose my stream if I do, probably, again. It's just on, like, it's only inside the Super Game Boy border. Which makes me think it's the cartridge itself. Like if it was if it was actually the connection, AV cables, I think it'd be the entire screen. I think this is the cartridge itself. All right. Well, let me um, let me fight Alan Smithy one more time, and then I'll move up the ranks. No, this is getting too bad. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop here, uh, just to. I'm going to turn off the cart and turn it back on. We'll do the password thing and we'll see how that works. So, one second. Let's see if it fixes it. Okay, so the music is there, but the picture is not. Um, I'm going to use some cleaning solution real quick, and then I'll try it again.
All right, hopefully that works. Hopefully we're back. Let me uh, get the color back to what one we were using before. And now, And now we question, why did I use such a long boxer name? Well, because I could. All right, let's try this out. We got 701GZ. Missing something? JQ? Am I missing something? 701 GZ P6 GB. Hold on. G B C K K J. There we go. Oh, and I have different fighters now. Rob is here. Instead of uh, Alan Smithy. I got Ray McManus down there. James Jackson. Patrick Murphy climbed up the ranks. He somehow skipped me. He was there before. Um, the Lopez twins. I believe I remember that from... Back in the day as well. Ivan Horn, Steve Thompson. I think a lot of these top few are uh, pretty consistent and will stay that way. So, I think we have Fight Rob. Let me see, is Alan Smith even on this list? No, he's gone. I'll fight Rob, uh, try to get a little more health, a little more power-ups here, and then I'll go up one at least, make some progress. Punches off right now. I'm supposed to have higher speed than this guy, but I can't do anything. There we go. No, I got two, two of them. It's an aggressive fuck, that's for sure. Damn. Just everything I'm doing is getting canceled. <laughs> like, oh man. I landed a whopping 33 punches on that. 34 punches. Ick. Shut up.
Mm. He's like that one guy from a couple of fights ago who would just do the freaking uppercuts every time I went down low. And then if I didn't go low, he would just keep hammering with the low shots. And I couldn't really uh, do much about it. I can't, I can't punch. I'm trying to counter, but he's faster. This is supposed to be an easier fight for me here. I seriously am getting beat on the speed front whole, like a whole, the whole time. <clears throat> He's just faster, even though it, it didn't look like his stats showed higher speed than me, but it's working out that way, that's for sure. See, I didn't want to go low because he was just going to do the fucking uppercut. I'm having a hell of a time with this guy. I don't know. Ugh. And he doesn't let up. He's not like... You know what I mean? Like he's... There we go. Mmm. Stop it, dude. Some of the guys will throw punches for a few seconds and then just stop and give you a little bit of an opening. But this guy is just swinging away. Once he gets in a, a groove, he's he's off to the damn races. Whoa. That one is tougher than I thought it was going to be, that one, but I made it, so. Very surprised, considering, like, the scores. <laughs> he, he really had me for a while there. Alright, uh, speed boots, I guess, maybe? Because that'll make my punches land faster, or first, a lot of the times. Sports drink isn't that much of a thing. It always gives me more power, though. Hmm. I feel like speed is more important. I'm gonna do the speed boots for now. Alright, let's get this password down. We got X01. Uh, is that a D? Looks like a D. Definitely not the same as the the O. And there's no zero slash you know, like zero slash O is, is all the same, so um has to be a D if it's not the same. J B N X did I get all that? X O one D Z P K S Q C J B N X. Yep, we're good. Alright, so that's like three fights below my level, uh, just to get a little bit more boosting. So let's, um, let's go up one, let's fight James Jackson, and then make a tiny bit of a climb up, and then uh, maybe do a couple more fights down below. 
Hey Lord Abrinth, how are you? You did not miss King Hippo. I am King Hippo, even though I'm not actually King Hippo. I'm going to be King Hippo at the end of this. I'm going to be just as good as him. Meaning my belly is going to be my weakness. I feel like um, each of these guys probably have their pat. I don't know if the... I mean, each person probably has its own pattern tied to the name. But I'm really not sure if it's pattern tied to like the body and face type or if it's like tied to the actual name itself. I'm sure there's some sort of exploit I can learn for each person if I needed to. That's a nice little sequence there. So I'm on the left. Every time I will be on the left. Oops. Ugh. I have my increased speed, but it's not helping me as much as I thought it would so far. He's... This guy is getting everything. Okay. Give me, give me a chance. I want to play two. Okay, there you go. No, I missed. Oh, shit. Okay. This is not going well for me. Definitely lost this round. Oh, can't even. This guy's trouncing me over here. Trounced. That's the only way to do it is to pin him in the corner. No, it's not a foul unless you're uh, unless you're hugging them. I'm not sure if you can do that in this this run. But look at that, 142 punches thrown. That's probably the most I've seen so far in around this entire game. Just non-stop. Yeah, all's fair in Riddick Bow Boxing. Besides, why do you care about if he's has a unfair if I have an unfair advantage? Whose side are you on anyway? Hmm. Couldn't get off. Damn, he's fast. I'm trying to do something, and uh, I can't. <laughs> he's too fast. He's leaving himself open on the head. But... You got the same idea. I was like three quarters of the way to actually hitting that body blow and he comes in and steals a shot off of me. Hmm. Really? Nothing? None of these are hidden? Damn. I'm on the side of entertainment. I want what's most interesting for the viewers. Yeah, me wailing on the guy is going to be more interesting. He still got 10 points too on that one. It's not fun watching me get knocked down.
Oh god. Plus, if I don't keep them in the corner, it's really hard to hit them consecutively because every every time I punch, I move backwards. Every time he punches me, I move backwards. So it's the easiest way to stay competitive. Mm, I can't do that. That's tough to do. Oh, trying to get all fancy with me, are you? Oh. I'm not trying to get greedy with uppercuts. I'm just trying to wail on you. That's all. Damn, I thought I was going to have an outside chance of knocking him down twice. He ended up landing more punches than me in that round. single one yet okay wow oh fast boy you're a fast boy speedy they don't give these boxers nicknames but he's oh he is a tenacious little Oh wow, okay, two two uppercuts in a row like that, huh? Okay. Not too many guys do that. Hmm, a little bit too slow for that. Quit backing away. Quit backing away. Damn. Problem is, like, I don't want to protect my body too much, because if I do, then he's going to go for the stupid uppercut. And I can't get up and block it in time. Oh. Oh, really? Nothing hit? Okay. I'm really surprised not- Oh my god! Oh! I am really surprised I didn't get knocked out there. Alright. I thought for sure I was down. That was the closest round I've had. God damn it. Okay. Fuck. Jesus Christ. Mm. I'm definitely going to be down here in a second. Fuck, there it is. Mm. 
How do I get up? small chance still. God damn, okay. There it is. Dude got knocked down twice, and he still gets nine points for the round. Amazing. Well, I guess I got knocked down once, so maybe that's why. If someone has to get a 10, then... Which I don't know if... I don't know how boxing works if someone has to get a 10. Crushed him. chance no chance anymore got him pegged wore him down just enough and now he's toast oh he got up okay TKO all right TKO he's mad he's a little teed off That was the first time I've been knocked down. Sports drink, or more speed boots. Uh, I think the sports drink, I need to get my stamina up now. I don't know if there's a specific stamina only item that I'll come across later, but if there is, then I'll grab that. All right, so now we got seven zero VB ZP four SS CJ six DL seven OV B Z P four SS CJ six DL All right, yeah. Seven matches in. Ooh wee. Okay. Seven matches in. Um, 
I'm assuming I probably shouldn't go for Coltrane. His stats are not terrible, but his stamina is quite a lot higher. I could potentially go after this stinker, but he's going to be pretty tough, I think. He's young. Um, James Jackson, is he, he's the guy I just fought, right? I'm pretty sure he is. That guy has tons of power, so if he hits me, then he's going to be in trouble. I think I'm going to do a couple rounds, and I think I'm going to do, um, we'll do James Jackson again here first. <clears throat> I don't want to try to climb up the ladder too high uh, without having my stats improved, so a little bit of a strategy game there. Crowd's on my side. Oh, how about that for a first round? If this is the same guy, then I've got him pegged pretty good. Sometimes it takes a couple rounds to learn patterns. Down he goes. Whew, okay. Oh, ho, ho, down again. Can I get the round two TKO? There's still a minute left. There it is. 
absolutely dominated that time. Jump rope. I think that's the one, because that, that increases my stamina a good portion, but also still gives me some power and speed. Nice. Okay, I'll take that. Maybe I'll get another one pretty soon, too. So now my new password is 7OV. 9Z P8 S Q C K 4 Q 3 9Z P Yep Very good All right uh give me a second I'm going to take a short break and I'll be right back to keep fighting Okay, we are back. I am back. I am ranked 17th in the world. I'm going to go against James Jackson one more time here. Uh, get myself more health because, oh my goodness, those guys have some big time stats. 32 matches left to, bite, to beat Riddick Bow. Hmm. 
got it. Can't get much better than that in the first round. Oh. oh my god, you are getting your ass handed to you. Absolutely crushed you. <laughs> That's tough to come back from. You had a nine count before. You think you're going to... You might, you might get up. Yeah, you got up easier that time. Well, that was quick. Another second round... TKO for me and so now we hit the gym we got speed boots free weights and sports drink we're doing sports drink seems to be the more beneficial round so far okay uh, X O V 7 Z P 8 SSC J six H nine X O V seven Z P eight SSC J six H nine. All right, I'm at nine and zero. Oh. Um, I think I could probably go for Ryan Little. So I think, yeah, sort of what my plan is, let me sort of math this out a little bit. Um, use number 10 to get to, match number 10 to get to here. Uh, how many more do I need? One, two, three, four, five, six, Could try to boost up two spots. Just don't want to go too fast, too quick. Some of these guys are mean. Looking. That guy has so much power, and he's only 16 fights into his career. This guy has a chance to be a beast. But he's older. All right, I'll try jumping up a couple. We'll see what happens. I might lose this one.
Mm. I'm not trying to do uppercuts, I'm trying to just do normal ass punches. That's pretty even. That was good, good even. He got me though. He had a lot of more punches. I have him on the stamina battle though. Damn. I think he's slightly faster than me, which doesn't help. Even when I get the freaking uppercut, he's like right there and like ready to start wailing on me instantly and I'm like vulnerable after doing my shit. He's got me pretty dang good, except for again, I'm I guess I'm hitting him harder overall or something, because his stamina is lower than than mine. So he may be hitting me more, but I'm hitting him harder, I guess. I don't know. Or I'm getting his little, you know, his his meter down farther most of the time. the don't have the idea yet behind this dude seems like uppercuts are really the the key but he just he won't stop punching to let me throw anything unless he does his uppercut and then once I counter he's right there with a barrage of punches so I can't Can't get much off. <sighs> yeah, I'm trying, dude. I literally can't even get close to you because you keep punching me every time I try to throw anything. You're countering all my attacks. 
Oh, Jesus Christ. I can't fully block right now. Okay, well, right, saved by the bell. Oh, man. He really, look at that. Like, twice as many punches. He landed 64. I only landed 28 that entire round. Tough to, tough to find a opening. Goddamn. I can't get like a combo or whatever you might call. Almost had an opening there. There we go. There it is, wow. This might last longer than six rounds though. I don't know if he's just changing up his strategy a little bit or if I just uh, happen to get a little bit luckier. He's much more defensive as you can see here. And, you know, when he blocks his face like that, it's easier to do the, the belly punch and uppercut combo. Which seems to be pretty crucial to my winning. He's down, huh? That was wholly unexpected. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I like your style. Why, thank you, Riddick Bow. I like your belt, and I would like to take it from you one day. Mmm, speed bag isn't a bad idea. Speed bag is basically the same as a sports drink. I guess I'll go with that. Alright, definitely need this password. XZQ5. C P8. S C B eight K three X C Q five Z P eight Q S C B eight K three. All right, I'm officially one quarter of the way through the career mode. At least the first try. If I don't happen to beat Riddick Bow before my career ends, I can hopefully just go back to an earlier password. If not, I don't know. That's going to be interesting to find out. If Because uh, the game will retire you after 40 matches whether you beat Riddick Bow or not. What I don't know is if it registers your name to the point where it's like, nope, you can't do anything else. Or if, I, I can't imagine that the passwords would not work. So anyway, excuse me, let's go ahead and uh, beat up on some dudes. Uh, I don't want to climb up the ranks too much yet. That guy's older, but man, look at that power. That's amazing. I think I'm going to go for Paul Little. Or maybe I should go for Dwayne Edwards. I'll go for Dwayne Edwards. Yeah, I think that's the guy I just beat. And so hopefully that'll be easier. Just want to do stat boosts, basically, is what this is about. My god, like 30 seconds in, he's already on the floor. Is that the same guy? Because, man, if so, they just must get a lot easier when you're higher ranked than them.
first round knockout after, what was it, four or five rounds last time? Speed boots. Uh, I might do the heavy bag because that's a lot of power and it gives me a couple other things too. That's pretty good. Alright, so I know that probably the, the most time-consuming part of this playthrough is just going to be watching me input passwords and verify them. <laughs> X is E, Q, 3, but I don't, I don't know, if I get knocked down, that makes things quite a bit tougher, so I kind of want to avoid that as much as I can. D, C, and then possibly, you know, if I have to start back farther, then I want to have those options. Uh, X, Z, Q, 3, Z, P... 8s d c b 7 b 5 i think i have that right um okay so did i go down in the ranks no i'm just, I, w I was at 15 and i'm still at 15 right there's dwayne edwards again he's at 17 um one more time against dwayne and then we'll climb up that's sort of what I've been doing. It's like two more to boost up the stats and then try to climb the ladder a little bit. So I don't want to be too underpowered going into those as I get closer to the top 10 those guys have you know near full bars of stats i need i need that so in order to get that i need to beat up on some of the littler guys again he's harder again he's he's trying he's trying to be scrappy about it He's going to make it around too. But not before I knock him down. Uh, if you get knocked down, you get up again. They're never going to keep you down. Did you learn nothing from tub thumping? Do I need to ban? Should I add that to the chat rules? Like, no chumba wumba. <laughs> i my only viewer, go ahead. I'm not doing it for the views. If I was doing it for the views, I'd be playing like more popular crap. I'd like actually try to engage the Twitch community more. I'm doing it so I have a record. I don't need you. Although I do need you to help me build an overlay. <laughs> I do want to try to get that going pretty soon if possible. Ah, let me get my... Remember when you, like, let me do a KO in the first round and now you're, like, trying again? I don't like that, buddy. Don't you know that your career is over?
Oh, damn, dude. So I can do power gloves. Ooh, jump rope again. That gets me pretty even all the way around. And boosts my stamina, which I am needing more and more as we go. Let's see here. X, Z, Q, 1, Z, P. Ooh, question mark. Interesting. <clears throat> S, D, C, B, D, 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 King, D, D, D. Oh, sorry, gotta crack my knuckles a little bit. I'm holding it as if it's a button masher because it kind of is. And so I just have the controller on my lap and I just have like my index and middle fingers on the A and the B buttons. So let's move up. Good God. Speed is insane. Comparable on other stuff, but he's super fast. Or I could go for this guy who is probably a little bit stronger than me in terms of power and stamina. Going for it. I might lose this one. Taunting does. Damn, dude. I mean, it adds a sound effect where there's like no music in the fights, so I guess from that perspective. He is fast. me to get like a star power or anything off of him so he's good at blocking Before I start the next round, let me see if I can find out in the manual. Is it gonna... Uh, oh, did I close the manual? No, I didn't. There it is. Alright. Um, aging and retiring. The more fights you have, the more your fighter will age as you do all other boxers you can as do all other boxers in contention. After your 40th fight, you're, you will be forcibly retired. Also be retired if you lose a challenge match with a fighter ranked 21 or lower. You may also be retired if you lose twice in a row against the lowest ranked fighters. I don't know if I even can taunt on my own. Uh, I 
doesn't say that I can taunt. So if I can't taunt, then there might not be any visible or, or noticeable... Um, uh, differences? Whatever. Oh, geez. Dwayne Edwards was originally ranked fourth, and I just kicked his butt a bunch of times. Is that the same guy? Alan Smithy was 11. I beat him up already, too. He's gone. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about taunting being a positive or a negative, so I guess it's just a thing that they program for the opponents. So. Okay. Good to know, just to make sure I'm not, uh, you know, opening myself up to them getting more stamina or something. Um, that was more even than I thought in terms of punches thrown. seems to be very susceptible to uppercuts in general. Like he leaves himself open to them a lot. Because he stays low and doesn't protect his head all that much. I do like that each fighter is different, and it's not like a... They're not obvious tells, you kind of just have to fight them a little bit to see if you can maybe figure things out on your own. This game is enjoyable. Dude landed one more punch than me. I tried hitting select to see if that maybe did something, because that's like the only button I know of that isn't something else, so... Let's see if maybe that would give me a taunt. It didn't. He punches me so I'm like too far away to do anything and then he taunts me. How did that uppercut not hit? Crazy. Oh, that one looked like it should have hit too.
He's good at protecting himself when his stamina is really low. He's able to anticipate my upper and lower attacks. Hmm. Somehow I got a 10 even though I landed 10% fewer than him. smart with the low energy. Oh, wow, I thought for sure he was getting up. Um, hmm. Heavy bag, I guess? The stamina difference isn't that much. Z L Z Z P question mark L G C B R S nine All right, I think I got I think I got it right. Alright, so now I'm ranked 13th in the world. Jose Lopez, Jamie Thorley look severely over overpowered compared to me. Loco Lopez is number two. Where's his Where's his brother? Jose Lopez is only one ahead of me. Wow. Okay. Um, yeah, I think we're going to fight John Mc McMegan again. I think that's the guy I just beat. Because, good God, look at that stamina and power. <laughs> and he's 12-1. and one. He could easily beat me. So, uh, yeah, my best chance is to fight John McMegan here. Get my stats up a bit more here. to get 
Your stupid punches are fast, so I'm trying to trying to get through. slightly faster than last time somehow. Couple of these, I weren't even. I wasn't even trying for the stupid uppercut. Can't even get a punch off sometimes. I feel like I have a good chance at knocking the stinker down and. There we go. I was gonna say, like, just actually do the uppercut. Mm. Thank you. Sucks that they can punch you away till you can't do the uppercut no more, but it makes sense.
God damn. It's so hard to know when he's not going to be doing that anymore. Ugh. taunt you now. Oh, Oops. No, continue, please. I was trying to select different things, see if I could taunt, but don't think I can. Gym. That's like the biggest boost, right? Not much different than the sports drink, but still better. And now we go with this, which is what? X. XZL. XZP. W S J C B Y P P Yep. All right. Um, I guess I'll go up one. Against Mick Corle Corleone. So I'm afraid to not make some progress. I got more power than him, I think. I think it'll be close, but I think I'll be able to do it. Yeah, a lot of these guys are going to stay near the top. Looking at some of these records, because, again, they can retire too. Like, Mad Maxwell, he might drop a couple spots as he gets older here. Same with Jose Lopez. He may drop out of the top ten, since it looks like he just got back into the top ten. This guy might drop too. So, yeah, I'm going to try to go up one spot here. And then, uh, we'll see how that goes. I feel like I had this dude like easily just a couple seconds ago and now he's like he's able to push me back pretty good. His stamina is really nice compared to mine, I guess. I don't know. Or just compared to other fighters I've 
face because he's able to recover that <sighs> so quickly. Okay. Man, that was... Hundred and forty two thrown. I only had ninety five. His overall stamina is worse, though. Meaning, like, his he has a gray bar that's farther along than mine. Damn, I can't counter. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Oh. I can't even get both hands up. I'm trying to get both hands up and it's not working. He's, he's so fast that I can't even do that much. Oh my god. I'm, I'm in trouble. So I can't do anything. He's just... Going to town, I can't counter. Just need a lucky opening, need a lucky break here. I can't throw a punch. Okay. Can't get the two hands up. this coming from? Damn it. I was like so close to having him anywhere and he just, oh my god, he's just so fast. He's so fast. I can't do anything here. Doubled my punches. Tripled the amount that I landed. Now I'm in real trouble. I can't... I'm hitting buttons to throw punches, and boy, they don't work. fast i can't oh my god like i get one punch off and i'm trying to follow it up and he's already like hitting me with like three or four shots in the meantime i'm dead oh my god i can't even counter his uppercuts that's like the most obvious opening is when i have an uppercut against me I survived that round. Again, he's like doubling the amount of pit punches thrown.
dude just throws so many punches. I don't know where my openings are supposed to be because he's just going to keep going. Oh my god, I knocked him down. Ten to seven. <laughs> he still landed five more punches than me that entire round. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I can't even get my hands up because, oh, god damn it. Fuck me, I'm screwed again. so much. Toughest fight I've had by far. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I can't block. I can't block. It won't let me block. so good at freaking blocking and I can't do anything about it. Uh, they know exactly where I'm going, but I can't even get the buttons to work because they're... Hmm. Okay, well hey, I still get an improvement. I still get an improvement on that. Um, I'll take down the password, of course, right? Like, that's, uh, it's still character progress, and I have, as I've said before, 40 matches total. That just brings me down a peg or two. 7ZLX1PYSJHC8LG. Okay. 
Who is that? Mick Corleone. Damn. His speed is really not that much different than mine, though. Alright, Al Matthews, we're going for you. We're going to see if I can maybe... This guy's easy. Oh, so yeah, as I was saying earlier, like I think it's probably just an SNES version where like the uh, the bars go across the the portraits of the heads too. That's what I remember playing as a kid more. It's so, or at least first. So I don't know if those are really different stamina aspects. But uh, that is definitely something that exists in another version of this game. Oh boy, should I do sp I should probably do speed, right? Mm, I'll do everything. Mad Maxwell, see he's falling down. He's he's down to fourteenth already. I might fight him. So I'm still afraid to go up. Fight these guys.
one more against we'll do Mad Maxwell um, or should I do Al Matthews again because I know I can beat him and it really doesn't matter I'll do Al Matthews again here Oh, down just under the two minute mark. It's not like I get better stat boosts by beating someone higher ranked, so I might as well go for the uh, the guy I know I fought and beat a couple times and get my stat boost that way. Sure, I was gonna have this. Really, you got me? no way of knowing like how many how many things he'll do before he goes for the uppercut oh got him down right at the buzzer Matches. Go for a lot of power. Oh, jump rope. There we go. That'll even everything out pretty good. Gives me a nice boost of stamina. 
All right, I'm gonna write down this password. I'm gonna take a very quick break, rest my hands for a minute. Uh, VC, VCM S one P O S P O S indeed B X H three VCM S one P O S J C B X H three Sounds good. All right. Um, all right. I'm going to take a short break. I'll be right back. Okay, let's continue on. Currently ranked 13th. I don't want to go too too hard on this to level up. Let's give Nick, let's give Mick Corleone another shot here. My speed, I think my stats are pretty much almost identical to him. Seriously, just can't get any stupid hits off of him. He's blocking everything somehow. Ugh! Oh, I can't get a fucking single thing off of him! Oh my god! It's like I start to punch and then it's just everything is cancelled out. He's so fast. What am I supposed to do? And he's just punching constantly. I'm trying to like find any sort of opening and I have nothing. Even when he does the freaking uppercut, he recovers and is able to throw punches before I can get anything in. Like that's supposed to be my chance and it's not happening. 
Wow. Yeah, again, 50 more punches total. Landed 30 more of them. I'm trying different tactics. I'm trying to like go low or something. It's just not... And I can't, when you're in a certain, when you're in a certain position, you can't adjust anything. Like you can't, it, it locks you into your position. So I, like, I can't block because it won't let me, uh, it doesn't, it just doesn't let you. So like these, this is where it's going to get hard. Oh, come on. I honestly can't do anything. I get sort of close, and then he just does whatever he wants to do. I certainly can't string together like two or three hits at a time, which I pretty much need to do. <clears throat> and like, I'm trying to shoot for his face, but if he hits me in the body, then that forces my guy to go low. Which means I'm no longer hitting his face, and he's blocking because he's already down low. So I need some luck. I don't want to fight this guy again. If I beat him, I really don't want to try to fight him again. But I think he's probably going to get me again. I don't think I'm strong enough. I might have to... See, I was so close to having something go in there, and now he's like all the way back up to full. Because he's able to block really easily, and then just like punch non-stop, and while he's punching, he's recovering, and now I'm like low. So I don't know. Very lucky knockout, or not knockout, knocked down. I just need to stay off the mat. As long as I can stay off the mat myself, then... Oh, fuck. I try for any sort of fucking opening and I can't do anything. even it's it's a very even match I still don't have like a good idea of how to combat him he's so fast it's like I just need like a good string of luck basically
Yeah, see now it's like back to where it was. He's just blocking everything. I can't block because, I don't know, like once you're in that stupid... If you're not blocking when he starts punching, it's really hard to get to a stage where you are blocking again. There's so much, like, pushback after you throw a punch that it's really hard to string together a bunch of them. Oh. He's gonna knock me down. Oh my god, how did I escape that? I thought for sure I was getting knocked down. Like hope he's gonna be close enough for me to do. <laughs> I've been trying to swing for this like three seconds here, and it won't let me swing. Oh my god! Mm. So annoying. <sighs> it's so hard. Our stats look almost identical. How is he so much faster than me? already almost down again. Fuck, dude, honestly? That sucks. He's too fast. He's too fast. Alright, that's nothing's happening now. Uh yeah, I'm dead. Damn it. He's so fast. I just get like locked in. I can't do anything. Ooh, exercise bike or speed boots? I'm gonna do exercise bike. I pretty much never see that. All right, so let's mark this down. We got V M, uh, no V Z M. Oh God, V Z M. S V N P. N D. H B Q P V. V? Man, that seems like a weird one. Okay, so there's that. Second loss. Mark it down. Damn it. Should I try one of these lower guys again? Should I just try it? Oh shit, I can't go for anyone other than Nick Corleo, and I can't go for Brian Ho Oh, I wouldn't want to anyway, look at that. Look at how much more speed that guy supposedly has than, than Mick. Let's give this a shot, let's give Eddie Lee a shot. I got passwords, what, what does it hurt?
Mm -hmm. Oh my god. It's so hard to throw punches. What? Mm. speed. Look at that guy. He's also got all the speed. I don't feel as helpless with this guy around, though. Fuck. Problem is, there's no, like, increase your blocking ability stat or anything like that. Really? I, like, my, my punch was like 85% of the way to him, and he was able to counter me and punch me first. down. Oh, man. I don't know if it turns out I have to start from scratch on this whole campaign for some reason, then I'll start out my guy with a lot more speed. Or try to focus on that stat over others as I build up. Or maybe stay lower on the totem pole for longer to boost my stats before I climb the ranks. Getting into that top 10 is going to be interesting. I'm 
I mean, all three of these stats are definitely going to be important in their own way, so... Oh, I thought for sure I had the uppercut. More stats, more stats for me. Let's go for the speed, I guess. All right, uh, we got X, Z, M, Q, V, P. 2Q, S, C, B, M, S, Q, C, V, X, X, C, M, Q, V, P, 2Q, S, C, B, M, S, Q. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, hell yeah. Mick Corleone's below me now. I don't have to worry about him anymore. Um, do I dare go for Court Thorley? Or, do I do one more battle against Eddie Lee, who I know I can beat, and then go up one more? Lopez is out of the second place now. Ray Claymore has taken over. Where are the Lopez brothers? There's Loco Lopez at 23 and 5. The other Lopez is down below me? He's out of it? Lloyd no good. Wow, interesting. They're like ranked like 4 and 5 and now one of the Lopez's guys is retired. He's out of there. All right, I'm gonna do one more against Eddie Lee. Um, Shocked that didn't knock him down. There we go. <clears throat> After this, I'll definitely try to go into the top 12. Not bad, got uh, first first round knockdown.
go for super speed or I could go for a little bit more well-rounded approach and go for the heavy bag or I could do a sports drink get my speed and stamina up yeah we'll do that bigger boost okay so now we got VCM NVP2 Q B, C, B, B, C, S. Okay. I got that. Alright, we're going to go for court thoroughly. We'll see if this works. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, that seems easier. He's definitely hitting hard, but um, I got a good advantage in terms of his stamina here. He's, he's hurting more. He's staying low a lot, so I'm able to kind of just uh, anticipate and he's not protecting his head a whole lot, and so I can do a lot more of the uppercuts, which knocks his stamina meter down quicker than what I'm getting from all the body blows that I've been absorbing. Uh, 
I'm trying. For sure, can I get a extra hit off of them there? But nope. Okay. Whew. He's hurt. He's hurting. He's he's down pretty low. He won the round, but in terms of uh, overall health, I'm in a much better position. God, there we go. Jesus, I can't. I couldn't get my punches off. Oh, wow. That was a shocker. Drink or heavy bag? I guess I'll still stay well rounded and do the heavy bag. So I'm now halfway. Through the career. Do I have that right? 
right, Z, okay, X, Z, P, L, V, P, 2, S, G, C, C, Y, F, 3. Okay. Halfway through the career in terms of a number of matches, because I've done 21 out of the 40 possible. I'm about halfway through in terms of the ranking. I have the potential to fight Loco Lopez, who has a bunch of power and more speed and stamina than I do. Or I could do Brian Howarth, who also has more power, speed, and stamina than I do. In fact, all these guys do. So I think I need to spend a couple more. Need to find a couple more lower level matches. Oh my goodness, look at John Haig, he's low. But that's about all right, so I guess we're doing Court Thorley again. He is a pretty good even match, he has a lot of power. But I beat him once, hopefully I can beat him again here to get some more stats. Oh my god, I did the taunt? How did I do the taunt? Might not be enough for this. Close. He's definitely in trouble. In danger of getting knocked out in the second round here. That might do it.
TKO then. So just straight up power, speed, or stamina. I'm inclined to go for stamina just because it's harder to come by. As a straight boost. Like the, the speed boots come up a lot. Power gloves don't come up a whole lot either, but the punching bag does. Which is mostly power. I'm gonna do, I'll do the stamina. Actually, you know what, power is lower, so maybe I'll do that. Hmm. I keep saying how speed is important though. That's the problem, all these are so damn important. one more match could try against Brian Howarth or I mean the power is pretty comparable there I wonder if maybe I should just uh, maybe I'd go for it or should I do one more against this guy I'll do one more against Court Thoroughly. Get that stat up again, and then we'll see what we need to do. I'm honestly not even trying to do uppercuts most of the time there. It's just because his hits throw me down, and then when I pop back up, it's like an automatic...
good. He was pretty damn aggressive and uh, surprisingly powerful there. tougher this time than he was last time. <laughs> Five uncontested hits in a row after you taunt me, okay. Hope that's what you wanted. Mm. God, I wish I could actually punch. It'd be great if I could counter some of this crap with punches. different than he was before. Ugh. He's not letting me get a knockdown on him because he's like able to do that stupid computer bullshit where their when their health is low they can guard and they know exactly where I'm gonna throw the punch and so they'll just block wherever. Super speed boots, gotta go for the super speed boots. It's a massive, massive boost to speed. All right. Good, VZP. 
J G V P Z X Q C B S M G. All right. Good God. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna try to get into the top ten. And then if I lose, that'll be it for the night. If I win, that'll probably be it for the night. <laughs> so this may be my last one. Uh, but yeah, let's try again the top 10. I've done 23 fights so far. I've only lost two. This guy is probably going to outmatch me. He has really good recovery so far. Damn, he's still, I don't know if he's quicker than me, but he's, he's about where I am in terms of speed. So I had a small advantage on that. Yeah, we're pretty, we're pretty evenly matched. That's good. This is going to be an interesting fight. Really? God damn it. Amazing how quickly these things can turn around. Mm. Oh, got a knockdown in the second round against this guy? Wow. No, 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 no. No, let me have a chance to. Here we go.
I'm surprised that wasn't another knockout right there. Punches are like halfway to landing, and then they, <laughs> and then he's able to counter. Come on now. You're the one who's blocking everything. You come on. Oh, really? You're trying to make it interesting, that's for sure. Oh! Ho -ho. With 10 seconds left. making it interesting. Hey Legs, how are you? Oh, time, I guess the time keeps going. All right. This guy hopefully is going down this round. You're catching me at the tail end of the night, unfortunately. This is probably my last one. I'm trying to crack the top 10 in the rankings. Ah, I can't get my blocks going. There we go. I'm on the left, just in case you wanted to know. I forget the name of the guy I'm fighting right now. <laughs> Down he goes. K.O. Fourth round, not bad. I honestly didn't think I would do that well because I was uh, significantly lower in terms of stats. Pretty good, but I'm not ready for prime time yet, says Riddick Bow. That's the third Riddick Bow cutscene I've seen. I'm not sure if it's based off of rank. I'm assuming it's based off of rank. Alright, so I could do a heavy bag. Give me a nice little boost of... Mm, I just did the super speed boots. I want to have some room for growth in there with the other ones. So I think I'm going to do the heavy bag, which will get me a little bit more well-rounded. So there we go. Let me get this password down. Um, X, Z, K, D, V, P. Y, Q, B, C, J, N, D. Do I have that right? X, Z, K. D V P Y Q B C F J N D. Yes. Awesome. Alright, so I think that's gonna be it for this session. 